starting this morning off at work because I realized it's the 5th of July. This is the day I should vlog, right? So right now I'm currently at work. Unfortunately, I do have to work at 4th of July. The Dallas suit does not close uh, for holidays. But we do plan on going. Let me take this off. Maybe you can hear me better. We do plan on going um, to watch fireworks when I get off. So I just wanted to pop in and say good morning and um, maybe I'll vlog a little bit later on on my lunch break. Uh, we'll see. I'm not exactly sure. I think there's some rules about um, me vlogging footage of me in my at work in my work clothes. So I don't want to violate any of those rules either. I will catch y'all later as soon as I get home. I'll be switching to the GoPro camera and hopefully we can get some good footage of our so real quick, if you want to see some footage of what I get to do today if you all are curious. Um, the department that I work with the department that I work with at the Dallas Zoo allow, um, allows us to be put at several different locations on different days so we're not bored with the same spot all the time. And so today I just thought I would share with you guys um, how lucky it is that I get to hang out with the hippos today. And so we have our mama hippo and our baby hippo. They're out of the water right now and I just I had to share it. <laughs> Um, they're kind of just hanging out, chowing down on some of the food that they have over here, and just generally just hanging out together. And I just thought it was neat. I've never seen them both up out of the water, so because I I haven't been put at hippos in forever, so I just I had to share. It. So I have some really cute footage that I'm going to insert right here of them too, and hope you guys enjoy. <laughs> you guys know where we're going? To the lake to watch the fireworks! Yeah! So as you can see, it's been uh, several hours now. I am off work and I have made it home. I got my kiddos all dressed in their 4th of July festive stuff. And we are off to Lake Grapevine. We are going to try and make it there before the parking lots close. But, um, so I will, we're going to try and get some of the fireworks shows, but because the camera doesn't really have like that great of uh, viewing in the dark, we're not sure how much we'll be able to get, but I'll try and get as much as we can. Um, but yeah, so we'll see you when we get there. So we did not make it to the spot we wanted to make because of, well, as you can see, bumper to bumper traffic and the area we're supposed to turn up to is up ahead and we're pretty sure that all these cars are headed in the same direction. So we were right, most of the cars were kind of sort of heading where we were going to go. They have unfortunately already closed the area off. The parking lot is full so now we're in the dilemma of trying to find an alternative location. Um, we're probably not going to have much luck. We're cutting it very close. The fireworks shows will start at 9.30 and it is already 8.52, so we'll see. I'll keep you guys uh, updated. Hopefully we find some place. So we safely found a spot to park. Now we just gotta figure out if we're gonna stay in the truck or walk somewhere 
up to an open field. Probably open field. We're walking! Yeah. <laughs> okay, so we hope we found a good spot. We're not too sure. Um, we are pretty far back from the lake and we do we are surrounded by trees a little bit So we will just have to wait. We've got about 20 more minutes before the show starts But I'll give you guys a look at what we're looking at so far. We're hoping this is a good area because we're seeing a lot of people um, staying um, Kind of camp out in this area but, um, We've never tried to come the grapevine for the fireworks show so we're not too sure if we're in a good area or not, but I guess we'll find out. So let me show you our view. So we're hoping that they'll be high enough that we'll see them in that general area. Oh, why is my camera not focusing? There we go. Um, we were over there, kind of in the grassy area over there. But we had a huge tree like right in front of us, so we thought it was a good idea to come this way. Um, but in doing so, we ended up with these trees kind of in our way too. But we'll just have to hope and cross our fingers that they'll be up high enough in the sky that we'll be able to see something. I think they will. Well, maybe. Like I said, we've never been to the Great Fine Fireworks show before, so we're not too sure how it'll turn out. I'm kind of hoping they'll stay up above the trees or at least in that little area like that. Yeah, but like I said, there are a bunch of cars and a bunch of people kind of camping out in this area, so we're just crossing our fingers that we look out and it's a good area. I'll keep you guys posted in about 20 more minutes. Um, 20 the, sh minutes. the show should be starting, so we'll see how it goes. Oh. <laughs> 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 So we moved <laughs> again because we saw lots of fireworks over here. Um, we just literally went from somewhere, oh, somewhere back over there to this spot. It gives us at least a better view, somewhat. We're hoping. We'll see. Think again. Still about 20 minutes away, I think. Let me time check. Is 19, so we're actually only 10 minutes away, but yeah. All right. Careful, please. <gasps> don't take your shoe off and don't kick your sister. Ha <laughs> 
It should be starting. So let's see. Oh. What? Ah, the suspense is killing me. It'll start any second now. <laughs> oh. oh. Now that sounded like it started. Yep. And we can't see anything. Where's it coming from? That sucks. It's coming from the lake, which I told you is further back that way. Dang it! What happened to the ones that live here? Those were from people who live here. The ones from the actual lake are further in, baby. Dang it! Yep. So, we're not in a very good spot. So, we're probably going to leave here in a few minutes. No. To try and find a we'll probably just end up going home and watching them as we leave all right let's go we gotta pack up we're not we're not gonna see them from here anyway so oh my gosh. Oh, there's so many back home because we thought it was gonna be a fail <laughs> and apparently we should have just stayed home the whole time because our neighborhood even though this year has done a lot even though it is technically illegal here in Texas to do fireworks at home I don't know about every other state <laughs> Texas, Police is um, if if you are in a residential area it is illegal to do fireworks at your house you must live on an open farm ranch that has lots of acres of land in order to be able to do fireworks fortunately we do live in a residential area but this is um oak cliff and not a whole lot of people uh pay attention to that rule basically so I wish I was recording. A few minutes ago, there was a bunch. There was a bunch. I like, literally right over there. They just came like, coming up and stuff, and they go. But I was busy putting stuff away inside and the house. And I can go to see. He just sucks. But I... the kiddos at least got to see oh, it. Oh, but you can see through the trees a little bit. Ah. So. Oh, oh, there goes one over there. A little bit through the tree over there. If you can see. You can see a little bit. Do they have to do, do it? Um, they literally like right over here, and they're throwing it off their backyard, so we can literally oh, see look. it. Like, and I will tell you this, you guys: the highway near our house coming in, we saw a bunch there, as I put in the footage. But the um, Hi. the air around the place is like really smoky, and you can notice it coming in from the highway. You went down, Bubba? Mm -hmm. Because of all, everybody who's doing all the fireworks around here. Oh, that was just a little flare thing. They just went shoot up. Oh, well, yeah, so we're going to be leaving here in a few minutes. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's good. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah.
I'm just gonna continue recording this way because the minute I turn it that way, one's gonna pop off over here. You just know it. I hear it. Way over there. Oh, I knew it. I got it. <laughs> That's a big one. Bam. It's gonna be too late. So basically, so that's how our Fourth of July Mama went. Me. We had me. better luck Mama seeing fireworks me. from our front yard than Mama actually going me. to the actual fireworks show. Mama. That's kind of crazy. Crazy people here. Um, I didn't record as we were leaving the fireworks show because, like I said, we got into our truck. We started driving away. Mama. We saw. Whoa, Baba. I know. I see them. We saw a lot coming back over here. All right, you guys. Um, <laughs> this is editing me uh, jumping in because I realized one, I didn't sure. finish saying what I was going to say, and two, I didn't close out the video. So, what I was oh, trying to say at the very end of that I'm night was. Um, I don't have to carry people now. Oh my god! Now I lost my train of thought too. Shoot. Um. Okay. No. Now I remember, as we were leaving the Grapevine residential area and getting onto the highway, we saw the tail, very tail end of the, uh, okay, right here. of their grand finale of their show. So, um, they got to see <gasps> a little bit as we were no, leaving the area. Um, but we saw a lot more once we started heading toward downtown Dallas. We hey, saw a lot thinking? more. And um, I, I'm not sure if I said it there or not, but basically we had better luck uh, watching fireworks from our front yard oh. than we did in Grapevine. But that was partially my fault because um, no, we had plans something. to leave here I at like 7 to get there, but then I second guessed myself and felt like 7 was too early. And so oh, we didn't leave our house until 8. And oh, once yeah. we got in the area, my husband my looked at me, he's like, we should have left at 7. I was like, yeah, house. we should have. So hopefully next year we'll be able to make it there, if not actually on the lake. We've decided that we might actually like try and rent a boat prior to yeah. the 4th of July and um, try to be on the lake when Oops. the fireworks go off. <clears throat> but, uh, so yeah. Now I'm going to end it. <laughs> I was originally going to combine this with another vlog the next day to try and make like a two-in-one, but once I went Hi, through editing that. and everything, I realized that this video would be way oh, too long to do that, so I'm just going to go ahead and end it. So if you liked the video, please leave your likes down below. If you have any questions or comments or uh, anything like that, leave them down below if you're able to. Like, I'm pretty sure my comments are still on. YouTube hasn't flagged me oh, as, um, I'm not oh, high up what? there on a person of interest type you thing, so I don't I think they've this. really taken notice, so even though there are kids in my videos and stuff, my YouTube, I my comments are still open, but I know oh, that there is a chance that that could change in the future. But if they're still available now, go ahead and leave questions and comments down Bye. below. Please leave this video a like, and if you're new here and you haven't subscribed, please subscribe and hit the bell notification to get notified every single time we post a new video, which I am trying to get better at, because um, after this video, I am vlog I do have another no. vlog set up. I probably won't no. upload it until tomorrow, though, but I, I, I give time for people to view this one. But yeah, so uh, if you're not subscribed... Subscribe, hit the bell notification, get notified every single time we post a new video. And until next time, see ya. Bye! Bye.